SCOTA infotainment systems receive updates primarily through two methods, over the air and USB. OTA updates are wireless and occur via your car's mobile data connection or Wi-Fi. They automatically update software, maps, and connectivity features if you have an active SCOTA Connect subscription. This method is typical for models from 2020 onwards, like newer Octavias, Superbs, and Carox. USB updates involve downloading files from the SCOTA portal using the MySCOTA app onto a USB drive and then manually installing them via the infotainment system. This method is mainly for older SCOTA models such as Bolero or Columbus and in areas where connectivity is poor, making it the more reliable option in those situations. SCOTA's map updates are now distributed primarily through OTA or USB methods, moving away from SD cards. This transition ensures more convenient access to the latest navigation data. OTA map updates deliver real-time traffic information and new points of interest through Here Maps, SCOTA's mapping partner. Wireless Android Auto and Apple CarPlay integration is standard on 2023 and newer models with the MIB3 system. Ensure your infotainment software remains up to date to support the latest Android and iOS versions for optimal compatibility. Wireless connectivity uses Bluetooth and Wi-Fi pairing, while USB connections offer greater stability for data transfer. These updates enhance functionality, including split-screen multitasking capabilities with Android Auto, essential for a better driving experience. Looking ahead, Skoda plans to completely phase out SD cards by 2027, relying entirely on digital update methods.